<laughs> yeah, I like it. I like that, man. This is out of shoe stores. Check out these, man. These are the people. I'm going to buy a little bit more. But, no. Ah, fine. <laughs> he's telling me to put my camera down going this way. He, I know he's trying to be very, yeah. he very, he's trying to be very, in my opinion, go say, yeah? Yeah. Uh, he's telling me it's more uh, yeah, dangerous in this area. All right. <laughs> I kind of figured he was trying to be a little bit more nice. So here we go. We're going into a more of a crazier area. <laughs> okay. Where you got people looking? What's up guys, I'm back in Mexico City in the downtown area. And if you can remember this guy, Mihao. Mihao. <laughs> I met him in my last video. We decided to just hit the streets together. He's gonna show me some parts or give me more insight on the area I was in. But we stopped here because these guys are doing something amazing. Let's check it out and then we're gonna hit the strip. Apparently, they're making some form of coins, and these coins eventually are gonna turn out to be one of these memorabilia items that they sell here. Uh, I guess for uh, tourism, why not? All right, not bad to start of the day. Listo. Okay. Come, vamos. If you wonder what my friend name is, name is Omar. All right, very cool. Uh, dude, Omar, tú estás aquí. Nació aquí en México. En esa ciudad. So he was born in this city right here, so he's the perfect person I could hang out with and get an insight. I was in the area by myself, I feel comfortable walking there by myself, but I think I get a better insight walking with a local. Anyways, if you like that, hit that like button and let's see what's up with Mexico downtown city life. All right, yeah. all right, so we're in uh, the intersection of Reforma and Escayuno, and uh, we're heading into what seems to be it's el más grande aquí. Marcado más grande, hay otro más grande. Hay más mercado más grande, igual, sí. pero vamos a entrar ahorita a visitarlo. All right, so this is one of their biggest uh, markets they have in the city, um, but there are others available. So here we go. This is uh, pretty much the entryway into the market that uh, we went to last time, and let's check it out. Okay, it actually is next to a local uh, train stop right here. So. If you're wondering, yes, Mexico does have subways. All right, here we go. Kind of dry today. I would assume the best day to come out here would be the weekend, but they are open without a doubt to get some, uh, if you are wanting to buy some clothes, they got it here. Hola, hola. Shirts going for 100 pesos, which is like five bucks. Okay, if I'm wrong, let me know. It's around five bucks. I see you, oi. No, más adelante. Okay, okay, all right. Sí, otra. All right, guys, check out some shoes. We're going into the shoes area right here. And then we go into the cosmetic coat area here. It's normal to see like hair salon places and stuff like that. So this is what you'll find here. Look, we got some nail polish right here. This whole bunch right here. Ah, makeup right here. This is the market of Lagunilla where you can find vestidos para fiestas, 15 años, bautizos, presentaciones, mira. Okay. This is the area where you're gonna find some um, formal clothing for like uh, baptisms and or like people's birthdays, weddings and stuff like that. Here you'll find it right here. Okay. Okay. Oh, All right, let's go walk inside. Oh, sorry. Okay. okay. So got a lot of tailors here to find a suit. Oh, okay. Look at this suit. This suit's going for 650 pesos. Uh, I don't know, guys. Uh, you let me know. Huh. Oh, okay. We got it. Hi, how are you doing? Bueno. Yo quiero tu pregunte cuánto es un vestido por hombre. Ok, sí. Bien. Tu pregunte, porque si yo pregunte, diferente piso. Ok. Uh, Alright, so he's gonna ask to see how much for vestido como este. Ok. Como el hombre, así. Ah, así. Sí. Ok. Vamos, okay, vamos. Va, va. Muy bien. Alright, let's go. Sí, got some wedding dresses here, ladies. Check it out. All right, here we go. We got another suit area here. 
¿Cómo este tipo de sangre qué es lo que cuesta? Este, Viene completo, ¿verdad? Sí. Mil doscientos. Mil? Mil doscientos. Ok. Wow. Ok, wow. Sí. Okay. So, thousand uh, two hundred. Not bad price. Ok. All right, we're going in. But this is this is where we get all the uh, stuff, man. These are these are big, man. These are uh, gown dresses for women, big situation. And then these are for the quinceañeras. Hola, cómo estás? ¿Cuánto es por una así vestida así? En cuatro mil quinientos. Cuatro mil quinientos por una. So. 4,000 uh, for one of those, okay? Ese es por un quinceañera, ¿verdad? Es para quinceañera y ya le lleva todo el equipo. Okay, wow. They do, they do a serious job. So yeah, this is for like the girls' uh, sweet 15s. <laughs> 4,000. So that's not that bad. That's like around um, $150. Ahí tenemos traje barato, caballero. Échale un vistazo sin compromiso. ¿Cuánto vale? ¿Qué precio tiene este? Este es $1,500. $1,500. Viene completo, ¿verdad? Oh, okay. Oh, sí. Well, that's us. Ahí tengo más baratos, por supuesto. Oh, look at that. ¿Cuánto es este tipo? 1500. 2500. ¿Dónde me queda? ¿Dónde me queda? Yeah, I like it. I like that, man. This is like uh don't show up to a funeral dressed like this though. Yeah, but this is this look like you would uh, yeah. What's up? <laughs> yeah, that's good, that's good. Guys, we found a costume place right here. So they got a monkey. They got all type of different things over here. Hello, how are you? Nice little church formal world right here. Not bad. Alright. Bueno. Sí. Ah, no tienes nada por mí. <laughs> Solo por mujeres, bo. <laughs> ok. Ah, una pregunta. Por el boda. Ese es por el boda, ¿verdad? ¿Cuánto cuesta en este? Hay desde dos mil. Hay de dos mil, de tres mil, de cuatro mil y de hasta de quince mil. ¿Cuál es el más bella tiene aquí? El más caro. El más bella. Este mire. Okay, this is their most, I think, expensive or dress right here. ¿Y cuánto es este? Doce mil quinientos. Twelve thousand five hundred for uh, this. Uh, I'm dressed pesos, so wow. Ese es el más caro. Sí, el más caro. ¿Por qué? ¿Cuál? Ese también, 12 mil. Okay. She's. They, she, they calling our prices. Uh huh, okay. ¿Y por qué? ¿Por qué es muy caro? Por la calidad. The quality, it's, uh, it's more expensive because of the quality. Toda su, toda su blonda. Uh -huh. Toda su blonda y toda su piedra que traen. Viene cocida. Mm. Su manga que es muy elegante. Basically everything here is this, uh, mm -hmm. it's expensive because of the extra detail they have on the dresses right here. So that's why they're a little bit more expensive. But you know what? For a wedding gown to be under a thousand dollars, that's that's unheard of, okay? So, si alguien viene y se dice yo quiero una original. Ah, pues viene y se le toma medida. Ustedes pueden hacerlo? Sí. Okay, so they can actually make original clothing here, original. So if you want, ¿cómo se llama esa tienda? Paolo. Novias Paolo. Paolo Novias. Paolo. Acá está, acá está. Aquí está el letrero. Okay, here's the tag, guys, just in case you want to go. And let me get a picture with the stairs. Ah, but don't me, amigo. Oh, 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 Toma, toma, toma. Toma, yo quiero una foto con él. A ver, ya sabes. Ajá. Sí. 
So we're walking in more deeper in as you can recall if you last see my last video at the end We were in this particular area. It's a lot more people today More importantly the stores are open. So we'll get to see more of the stores uh, Perhaps I can buy my new wives a gift All right, if I can speak about the weather guys uh, basically the weather here is Unpredictable unless you're looking and planning because in the daytime it'll be warm like what it is right now but give it a couple hours, it'll rain, and it'll start getting cold. It's been doing that for the past week, week and a half. So we just uh, gotten accustomed to the, the random type of weather. So we see some people with jackets, <laughs> like I'm wearing one, just in case. Okay, if you're out and you can't find any, you know, you just have to switch up your, your clothing. What's up, man? What's up, man? Okay. Está el comercio donde venden varios artículos como pantalones, eh, gorras, playeras para hombre, para mujer, para niño. Más que nada aquí es parte comercial donde pues la gente le gusta venir a trabajar. Okay, so guys, we're in the area where the, more of the regular clothes are at. As we go deeper, I didn't realize how long this strip was because when I got here, pretty much everything was closed. But it it's a several different blocks of this clothing and the other garments you can get for seems to be sweet prices a uh, hundred pesos and you can get something from here for around a, for five bucks so that's a good deal here some of them are two for one to be exact yeah. <clears throat> all right you got some glasses here let me see here so, get some one of these glasses here so they're going for like 250 a, a piece Come on, let's see if this fits me, guys. Okay. Uh, si. 50. Mm -hmm. Okay. 50 pesos. Get a hater off my back. Gracias. <laughs> Paid uh, pretty much $2 or uh, 250 or something for a pot of shades, guys. Tell me if I look good with it. Huh? Huh? See? See or no? Okay, I can put it in. Okay, now we have to do it. Okay. 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 It's clear actually too. You can basically see a lot more with these glasses. I like how the glasses with the nice little tints on them and everything. You can see. Check it out. Yeah. Pretty much can see everything. Now with these on. Uh, got cops in the area. We'll get out there way. Or security. Hey, what is this? Para el centro. Aquí para el centro. Aquí para Tepito. ¿Cuál es mamá o tú me dices? Los dos, ¿cómo que vamos para allá? ¿Y qué es este? Igual te pido, igual. Allá oh. podemos ir para acá, para plazas comerciales, todo. Regresamos, vamos para Tepito. Oh. Oh, 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 ¿Y allá? ¿Qué es este? Allá Tepito. ¿Tepito? Allá. Vamos para allá un poco. Pero, pero no. Ah, mano. <laughs> He's telling me to put my camera down going this way. 
he, I know he's trying to be very, yeah. he very, he trying to be very, in my opinion, go say, yeah. Oh, he's telling me it's more uh, yeah, dangerous in this area. All right. <laughs> I kind of figured he was trying to be a little bit more nice. But here we go. We're going into uh, more of a crazier area. <laughs> All right. Let's walk in. <laughs> so we got people looking. Okay, okay. Okay. Alright. Alright guys, so after the street thugs uh, told us to put the camera down, we put it down for a second. Uh, but I'm back at it. I'd be a little bit more crisp, uh, discreet on holding my camera. Um, down. Just so that would be alright. Alright. Just to give you a good idea of how this place looks. But, uh, we're going to be in and out as soon as possible. So, pretty much, it just seems like this strip might be a, a strip where they, uh, serving extra stuff besides clothing and uh, uh, and movies. I think you can get anything in this particular area. And uh, yeah, just gotta be careful because I don't know how organized these guys are. <laughs> okay, <laughs> in terms of, hey, watch out that black guy, he had a camera on. But, uh, for the most part, very interesting area of this area of the. But for the most part, this is a very interesting area of uh, Mexico City. As you walk further down this way, the streets are getting even a lot. You can tell more rustier down this way too. Ah, okay. Ahora. Okay. Todo ese lugar aquí. Ahorita está muy tranquilo porque el operativo, el operativo policía. Oye, mercancía, esto feo y. Ah. Por eso ahorita está tranquilo. Hoy es tranquilo. Pero otro día. Pero ahorita poco comercio por lo mismo. Mmm. All right. Okay. Poco comido por lo mismo. Ahorita. Por ejemplo, mercancía este, pirata. Ah, ¿Qué pasó? Policía se lo lleva. Uh -huh. Se lo lleva, no está permitido. Oh, la policía. Sí, ajá, así es. Says, um, my guide is telling me, not only do you have to worry about uh, the sketchy people, but you also gotta worry about certain cops. They might come and get you too. Depending on what you have to do with it. Not bad. <coughs> oh, but it's a guy at Diana. My hand, I keep. You said you put it, but I thought the rope is more barato. It's more barato. So, pretty much, guys, just, I just noticed a little bit more people on this end. And because the clothing's a lot cheaper here. So, people will be searching in this area because they find the cheap there's cheaper stuff here okay. not bad all right let's go deeper in there <laughs> okay this is the Check out shoes for All right, so shoe store here. Hola. Then I'll go for Jordans. Jordans? Uh, what's up? The Jordans. 
So guys, we made it into um, one of the uh, exotic shoe stores. Check out these, man. These things look really good quality. Red bottoms. Quanto son? Cinco mil. Okay, uh, 500. Um, uh, cinco mil. ¿Qué cinco mil? Cinco mil pesos. Cinco. Uh, okay, so this is like a, t a couple hundred bucks for these shoes right here. You can tell based on the quality, it looks really good right here. And the Dior, but I'm interested in the, that one right here. Not bad. Some nice Nikes right here, guys. Wow, check these out, man. These are, those are dope. And this is like nice leather. This is real good leather. And quality here, muy bueno. <laughs> You gonna start, you gonna start hard. 3,500. 3,500 for that one right there, okay? Basically around 150 bucks for those shoes. These Jordans right here, these are going for uh, 1,200. So you can get these around 50 bucks for these shoes right here. But look at that one right here. Look at this, guys. Not bad. See this. Okay, so these are the Bad Bunny styles. He tries to use the one of accessories. 3,000 pesos for these right here. Not bad. You, we all know who this guy is. <laughs> Pretty much, guys, they do have a lot of um, knockoffs, but for the most part, these things really look like good quality, if you can tell. He says this changes colors. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, wow. Same shoe. Wow, it's a bueno. Wow. More dope uh, style shoes. How much are these? Basically, he's showing me all his different exotic shoes. This one's a Nike mixed with a Dior. Okay. And so this guy brought all his uh, 12 size Jordans. None of them I, I'm attracted to, but we'll just look at all the size 12s. Uh, yeah, these are all, this is a Jumpman right here edition. All right. It kind of looked tight. I ain't going to lie. The quality kind of looked a little bit off. Mind you, he didn't get it from this store. He got it from a different store. And these are some Nike stepped on. Because <laughs> they got stepped on. I got these Timberlands. Wow. Oh, no good. <laughs> what is it? You? All right. Oh, hey. Uh, and YouTube. All right, guys, so we're walking out of the area and now we're walking back deep into the fray. Um, of what is this market? Tepite. Tepite, otra vez. Tepito. Tepito market right here. And it goes on for days. As you can see, this crowd keeps moving. And today is a Monday. So I can only imagine how Saturday, Sunday, and even Friday could be. But I'm thinking Saturday would probably be the, the day where it's super packed here. Aquí, sábado, muy, mucho gente. Viernes, sábado, domingo, mucha gente, mucho tomar, mucho muy bien. So here, a lot of people is here hanging out, enjoying their time, drinking, having a, a, a good time. Okay, so we'll go that way, okay. All right, he, I've, he's been following my way for a while, so I'll let follow his way. <laughs> he probably don't want to go that way. Huh? peligroso. <laughs> I'm going to give him a chance. I'm going to give <laughs> He lives here. <laughs> I don't live here, so I'm going to give him <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> see, 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 no, no problem, no problem. We'll, we'll walk by. I think you got the point of the area. <laughs> How far deep can we go, you know? <laughs> so I guess this is an area where you can find some um, some cheap secondhand shoes. It gets a lot cheaper in the area. So, interesting. ¿Cuánto es la ropa aquí? Barato, mira, por ejemplo, me voy a preguntar aquí, este lado. ¿Qué pedí la ropa? Dos pesos la ropa. Dos pesos la ropa. Dos pesos. Hay wow. variado. Hay wow. variado de ropa. Hombre, mujer, niño, niña. Tiene variado, mira. So, two pesos, guys, for just uh, clothing here. Ah, bueno, es buen piso. Yeah. This would be a, like a thrift store dream. If somebody like this goes looking for stuff that are like vintage and old, yeah. this is, would be the, the best places to get all this uh, good stuff. Not bad. Two pesos. Uh, you could get 10 items for one dollar. This market is really big, man, guys. It's, it's huge. I'm just like, when are we gonna exit this thing? 
I can imagine people come here, if they're looking for a particular thing, they'll spend all day just looking for because so many options here and so many price points. This is shoes. Buenas tardes, patrón. ¿Cómo qué cuestan estos? 500 so he's saying those shoes should have went for 200 pesos we kind of figured that guys he caught on the guy caught on on me real quick you know what i mean he saw when i asked him but anyways let me put these uh, things down just a little bit okay so we're about to go into the area where all the food at and see exactly what they get over there serving so we could have a good idea hey, that's a nice man this is like a labyrinth you can get lost here gente puede perder aquí caminando you lose all type of stuff stuff in here you can lose your mind up in here too <laughs> you know another thing too guys walking through all these uh street corners and labyrinth i haven't really seen any authorities here to be honest with you the only one we first walked in but uh, i see no authorities at all okay so we're walking into the area where the market of the food food market here muy bueno Acaro de Sonora. A chuleta. Oh, es un husky. Husky. Mm. Hola, ¿cómo estás? ¿Qué viene aquí? ¿Ah? 